Uh, but here we go. LD, I think if he wins, he'll take back his number one rank on our ELO. Bark wins, pretty sure he will retain the number one rank. It's all riding on this. So I actually didn't get to see their first match, so I don't, I don't really know how it went. I imagine it was pretty close. Yeah, LD was pretty patient. Oh, there you go, Honest yep. Guardable. <laughs> and it starts. He just, he gets so tricky with it. Um, you know, he has all these different angles that he can take, and I really think he reacts to that stuff like, right yeah. before it happens. Oh, not now able to chase. Bark hasn't really been able to get in. I don't know if he's looking around for that opening. He did get that nice drop down back air before. Going for it again. Up. Jabs. Get can bark jabs, it out. Yep. Up to jabs. Yes, with a quick attack. Oh. But LD catches the read. quick attack with the down air. Uh, we saw uh, Wangara at G3 do a really good job of catching the quick attack. He did it with an up tilt with Jigglypuff. And I think after that, uh, a lot of people went, oh, wait. I can just kind of wait for that quick attack to come out and throw a move out, you know, half a second later than yeah. I normally do. Because uh, you can catch him. He's not invincible through the whole attack. Nice. Edge guard by Bark. Hold on. Yeah, Pikachu's got a hurt box through the length of the actual movement of the quick attack. Yeah, as soon as it starts moving. Now, the hurt box is very small, I think. I don't think it's like the size of Pikachu or anything. Oh, LD, Good. no DI at all. Yeah, he tries to fade back to do the, uh, the up B. That's what he does a lot. Uh, throws people off, but, you know, Bark is used to he's it, used and to Pikachu it. can just jump out there and back air without having to worry about making it back. Plus, LD uses Fox's fall speed to, like, manipulate as he moves. Yeah. Fo Fox can, like, bob and weave like crazy once he gets once he uses that up B. Yeah, that's another thing LD does a lot. He uses a forward air on a recovery. He's a pretty good hitbox to it. Is that drill to two jabs for not Yeah, space? yeah. Uh, down air to jab is, I think, it's really completely safe and it's really good. A good way to set up a kill is Fox. Because his jab does set up to up smash at a, a lot of yeah. percentages. Oh, second place, no good. Bark with LD off stage. LD manages to grab the edge after the forward air. Bark gets out of there. That's what LD's oh, been doing. Tight. To bark today for shield pressure. He's been jabbing him, then turn around on the other side of the shield. Yeah, and I think he does that a lot when he's worried about getting grabbed. Because mm. a lot of people, you know, once they shield that jab, they'll immediately go for a grab. So by pivoting around, he avoids the grab. All right, so Bark, yep, taking this three stock. Now, since Bark's coming from losers, he, he will have to beat LD in two sets. Um, we've actually seen LD lose the first set of Grand Finals many times. Um, I don't know if he uses it as like a training set or what, but he loses that first set a lot when he uh, when he's on the winner's side. And then he just like goes Super Saiyan in set two. Or loses, you know. Yeah, so he, he got out of there because he knew that grab was coming. Another thing that Pikachu can do that we saw Bark do once is a uh, jump in neutral air out of shield. I'll be using that double jump. Almost gets punished for it. Nice shield jump. Oh, the double laser. Almost a good setup. Nice. Tried to tech back away. Didn't work. See if he can get back to the stage. He gets up tilted. That's that should be it. I don't think he can make it back from there if he wanted to. So Bark taking the first stock. Jab. That's it. Jab. Vintage LD. Back roll, jab, up smash. <laughs> <laughs> like it shouldn't work. But it does sometimes. Nice. Bark's done a good job lately of coming down in between the platforms and throwing out that back air with Pikachu. He tries doing it again and it actually works. Oh, standing laser. 
Ouch. Fox sit there for, sits there for so long and does standing laser. Wow, he does get back. On edge guardable. I mean, this is why there's a whole video about it. I had to cut a minute of footage. Really? And I made it. <laughs> and to make it fit the length of the song. Oh, nice. Bark sneaks in that crab. Caught him going from Mackerel to Jab. Again. Wow. It's the range on oh, oh, and he misses. So he wow. was facing the wrong way, so he had to... He had to pull towards the stage a little bit with that up B if he had any hopes of grabbing a ledge. He just went too far. Up to up air. Oh wow. I don't think he wanted to land on the platform, the top platform. Just missed that combo. See like there, he knows that quick attack's coming. So instead of immediately trying for the jab on shield, he could actually wait that split second and jab him out of the quick attack. Which would be awesome. <laughs> I mean, I think, the shines today. Yeah, I think LD taunt cancels, even though Fox doesn't have a taunt cancel. <laughs> Fox doesn't really uh, make a noise. Totally no, yeah, he, exactly. Him and like Kirby and Link. I think they're the ones that can't taunt cancel. Kirby can if he if he absorbs someone's power. Bart nice, those up airs. LD finally sneaks in a down over, then just gets grabbed out of his jab. Nice edge guard from Bark. Doesn't need combos, just hits. You no, you do, against Fox, you don't need combos. Wow, it's so quick. Fox can get those combos. And he had to just keep jabbing to get Bark up to a high enough percent. <laughs> I think that was the first thing LD told me the first night I came to Xanadu. Cause he asked me who I played, told him Fox, and he said, jab, jab, up, smash. Yeah. He said Fox and his eyes lit up. Yeah. He <laughs> took me under his wing, like, immediately. He loves Fox. All right, so Bark on last stock here. If he takes this, he'll reset bracket the bracket. Reset. Yeah. Nice. He pivots around to avoid the grab. Down tilt so good. Oh, he, LD keeps enough. doing that same thing. The sub. Oh, oh no! He is still on his guardable. Oh wow! Uh -oh. Nice grab. Yeah, oh. Bark just holds on. All right, so bracket reset. He does have to play another. Bark restarting the song again. It's probably just some like obscure like anime song. <laughs> He's playing like a DDR soundtrack. <laughs> he doesn't want to tell us. <laughs> I said to a uh, who was a V that was up here earlier. I think it's just the Dreamland song. <laughs> some people do that like they you know they just have the headset like plugged into the uh -huh. TV or the soundboard or whatever so they can listen to the game audio. Yeah, I play other Smash games. I'll play with like separate music, but. When I play 64, I gotta hear the game. Like yeah, the sound, I love the 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 hit yeah, sound effect. It's They're really so good. Like a, I guess you could say punchy in a yeah. way. You know, for the oh, yeah, like horrible it, dad joke. It's very but. yeah, very like 70s, 80s action movie. Like the huge sound effects for every every time a move connects. Good combo by LD. Wow, she just made it back. Even those quick attacks. Oh, he dashed instead of up smashed. A lot of foxes will do that by accident because they're trying to get that little like dash up smash and they'll accidentally do a dash attack. There he wanted to do dash attack. Oh, that reverse forward air. Not gonna do it, down smash well. Bark getting getting up to almost 160%, which is pretty impressive with Pikachu against the Fox. For a jab starting at like 70, we'll end it. <laughs> yeah, he's not coming back from this one. The thing about playing Pikachu, Pikachu's gonna get back no matter what. So you can just like throw out a bunch of attacks just to make sure Fox won't make it. 
That one was that was kind of normal. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow, dash attack at low percent is bad. So that's a really good get up option as Pikachu. Get up uh, up air again because of the no hurt box thing. Oh no! Oh. LD pulls an Isaiah, misses the ledge. Dash attack on Lich, he seems to be really favoring that. For yeah, Lich he'll do that a lot. He's oh, been hitting man. a lot of them too. Like he's been throwing it out to, you know, just kind of get Bark thinking about it. But he's been hitting a lot of them too. Yeah, it's just, it's not going to kill, like, ever. But it will set up an opportunity for, like, further edge guard. So there you go, Bark. 161 that time. So first stock 158, second 161. LD's having a hard time finishing him off. And that double laser is a great approach against a lot of characters. But Pikachu getting hit by him can usually jump out. LD just wants to get on stage. He does, but then he rolls away. Pikachu gets a back throw. Oh, Bark doesn't cover the ledge. Comes jab to up How smash. far is he gonna walk him? See again, LD having a hard time finishing him off. Can he get back this time? Oh nope. no! He weaves Pulls too away. far. So Vark looking to take three games in a row. Oh wow. He actually didn't go for the up smash back throw instead. Because he felt it was safe. We do know there's a lot of hits done in this game. So again, LD going for that same approach, that double jump, and then trying to come fastball down air. And he keeps losing it. He's going to play a little more. Patient. He did land on the platform. He got to jump back. Used it. All right, he does DI there. LD can DI. See, again, same thing. Double jump fastball down air. It's going to lose to that Pikachu up air every time. Unless the Pikachu makes a mistake. Let's see what he's got. Nice. That down air is such a good option. I was wondering what he was going to do. So, last stock. Oh, man. Does it again. Wow. Triple laser gets the last one. Wow. Mark Sanchez. That grab was crazy. And you can just hold on. LD dies. There was one time, uh, this was like early last year, maybe like March or April. Mark Sanchez had a one. It was going to be the first time he ever beat LD. He was hanging on the ledge and he like pumped his fist. But he got up off the ledge. Oh, the LD no. grabbed it and then turned around and killed him in one. <laughs> it was it was pretty hilarious. Um, that we definitely made fun of him for that for a while. The fist pump. <laughs> now he waits till he wins the fist pump. Seems like the uh, optimal way to do. Gotta that. wait till it says game set. <laughs> All right, so Bark Bark's just took three games in a row. LD, I don't think he's gonna change characters. I know he's beaten Bark with Falcon before. But I don't think he'll change. He's too loyal to Fox. Yeah. I just think LD needs to play a little more patiently like rather than trying to force the double jump down. down. Yeah, he just keeps doing it and getting punished for it. He, uh, we like to joke that LD's a robot. You know, he just he just like sticks with his programming. You know, he just does the same thing over and over until it works, even if it's not working. Double down tilt. It's gonna be. That's not gonna kill. Wow. A little early for that up smash. Yeah, up until now, probably the only time I've seen him up smash without a, a kill has been at a major. I don't think I ever saw him do it here. Uh, 
Oh, that was dash attack. That's the thing, like, Pikachu can't sneak in a sweet spot underneath Fox dash attack. So it's not like it's safe or anything, he just likes doing it. Oh, back here. So again, bark at high percent. 158 again. Goes for the double jump and gets immediately punished. Or maybe it wasn't a double. Whoops, my bad. That was. <laughs> Man, those, doing those lasers really close to Pikachu seems dangerous. And I see he does make it back. Ooh. Wow, that somehow worked. A little back air to up smash. But now he's off stage at high percent. Not a good spot. Oh, Bark hits him onto the stage. He throws him right back him. I don't know if he did tech or what. That's crazy. Oh, he missed. Trying to catch him. All right, so he's, does he have him in range for a combo? No, but it'll Back hit him away. Tack it on that damage. Wow. That weak forward air immediately to jab. That was pretty cool. Oh, he missed the jab. Gets that up smash. 152. Bark at high percent again. Bark living forever. Yeah, I mean, LD took that one at like 89. Another like, quick back air to jab. He's telling Pikachu you can't drop through that ledge. Is Shears talking yet? Now that the is, he's in the, is he not? Because the tournament's still not over. I haven't, I haven't heard him. It's yeah. so quiet here. Shears following. Oh wow, Wispy! Right? I don't know if Wispy had a factor. LD just totally botched that. And again, Bark with the the get up up air. He's caught LD with that many times. That's a trade that. Bark will take. Oh, for sure. Now he's at another really high percent. 160. Oh, wow. I thought he was going to make it for a sec. He's going to be shocked. Double jump. Again. Getting punished. Straight across. Yeah. All right. Last stock. This is LD's last chance to not lose. Last chance to go to number one, but he's off stage. Magically gets back. Off stage again, down tilt, nice. And LD it. loses. LD stays at number two, Bark stays at number one. Bark with that complete down LD, we'll see. Let's we'll see if he learns next time. 